For more videos visit ForTheSakeOfEducation.com Alright guys, now we're going to do this problem that says determine the magnitude and coordinate direction angles of the force F acting on the support the component of F in the X and Y plane is 7K Alright So F we don't know but we know that the component in the X and Y plane is 7K So f of x is easily you can tell that it would be this force right here which would be 7k cosine of 40 degrees which is equal to 5.36 kilonewtons f of y is this force right here which is 7k sine of 40 degrees but you gotta see that it's going towards a negative y direction so it will be negative 4.5k and f of c will be this force right here Now you know that F cosine of 30 is 7K because this is F and this is 7K. So F cosine of 30 is 7K, this equation right here. So dividing 7K by the cosine of 30 will yield you um, F, which will be 8.08K. Let me put it up here. 8.08 kilonewtons now we got k now we need to find this f of c which is equal to f sine of 30 which is this vector right here which is equal to 4.04 .04 kilonewtons this is f of c now we need to find the angles the first angle, which is the one it forms with the x, is cosine inverse of f of x over f. The second angle is the cosine inverse of f of y divided by f. And the last angle, which is the angle that it forms with the c, is cosine inverse of f of z with the f. So these angles are 48.49. Here when you do f of y, remember to put the negative sign too. If you don't put the negative sign, you're going to get the, the angle uh, aiming towards a positive. You need the angle aiming towards a negative, which is this angle right here. So remember, negative 4.5. Okay, let me write it down. For this one is negative 4.5 don't forget the negative otherwise it will be wrong and the angle that it should give you is 123.84 degrees and the last angle is 60 degrees so these are the final answers for the angles final answer for the c component the force the x and the y